Rumbling along the Southern California coast, Amtrak Surfliner takes you to the beach and to some incredible sights in this part of the Golden State. It's an example of a regional train supported by the state of California and part of the Amtrak system. The Surfliner goes as far north as San Luis Obispo and as far south as San Diego. It passes through the hub of Los Angeles. You can come and go to and from San Luis Obispo on the daily Coast Starlight. Although San Luis Obispo is not on the ocean, there are scenes of great beauty near this small city. Oh, I like that one right there. Picture snap right there. History fans will find plenty from the past here including the mission that gives the town its name. Rolling south out of San Luis Obispo, the surf liner soon lives up to its name, hugging the Pacific Ocean coast for over a hundred miles. The surf liner will take you to Union Station in Los Angeles, where local transportation is easy to use. You can board long distance trains here as well, including the Sunset Limited to New Orleans and the Southwest Chief to Chicago and the Coast Starlight. But to go south from here, you need the Surfliner. South of Los Angeles, the Surfliner brings you right up close to classic California beaches. Plenty of surf, parks, lifeguards, and sunshine. At San Diego, you can visit Old Town, buildings from San Diego's beginnings. Visitors can learn how these early San Diegans lived. Pioneer residents of San Diego had to be self-reliant there were very few luxuries, and most things they needed, they had to make themselves. In Old Town, you get a quick glimpse of the life they had back then. The surf liner terminates at San Diego's Santa Fe Station, named for the railroad that provided passenger service in the past. Santa Fe Station is a full-service Amtrak station. There are still some touches here of Railroad's golden age. Today, the station serves passengers of the Surfliner. It's located near the waterfront. San Diego has always been and continues to be all about the water. If you're interested in maritime things, there's a lot for you to enjoy along the waterfront in San Diego. It's easy and cheap to get on this glistening water. Just board the ferry to Coronado across the bay. We pass the USS Midway, an aircraft carrier that's now retired and welcomes visitors as a museum. You can get to Coronado by crossing this highway bridge, but then you'd miss the trip across the water and the great view of San Diego's skyline from the bay. Coronado contains a huge Navy base and upscale neighborhoods, plus a great view back at San Diego. Balboa Park was the site of the World's Fair 
and has some great architecture in a garden setting, but we kept finding ourselves back at the waterfront. There's a captured Soviet sub here, and you can explore it inside and out. You can see tall ships here, one called the Star of India. You can book a harbor tour or take a whale watching cruise. You can almost always see aircraft carriers at the Navy base and see the carrier's helicopters getting ready for their next mission. San Diego is, among other things, a Navy town. Amtrak Surfliner brings you here and takes you home. Thanks for watching.